Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to The Walking Dead on PS4. We are deep into episode 4 now and we have so far discovered a dead child, Walker, in the house. Um, a dead dog, which we use the collar of to get into the house. And we have a stalker. So now it appears that me and Kenny are on the warpath to find out what's going on. As usual, my name is Mike, otherwise known as the Gadget Addict, and to my right is my lovely wife Emma. Hello. She's learned to do it by herself. She's very proud of her. Let's carry on. <laughs> infected. The broken windows, the infected warrior, East Bay Street, Lincoln Street. So what is this business? He's determined to get that boat. The homeless man never come back? No, he didn't, did he? Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there, in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, River's we... right up ahead. Son of a bitch! That bastard's fucking with us again! It's another trap! No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Oh. What in the hell is going on? Uh, keep your voice down. Someone must be wearing those bells. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. <laughs> Good one. I have a feeling that we're going to get to the to the river and there's going to be no boats. boats. Emma's clearly interested. I don't know if you heard that very big yawn in the background. Oh, I'm sorry. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Uh-oh. No boats. Told you. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Everybody else had the same plan to get to a, a place with it, where you can get a boat. This one might still be salvageable. Kenny, get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh, yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Tell you what, if I ever need an expert opinion on American history, I'll be sure to ask. But how about you leave the nautical shit to me? Okay then. And Kenny may have finally snapped. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Really don't think there's going to be another boat. Where's the telescope? There it is. Great. Needs a quarter to work. Oh, I heard a walker. Damn. Built solid. Oh god, they were hanging them. 
Maybe one of them has a quarter. I was gonna have this skewer in them. Is this meant to be some kind of warning? We'll do something like this. You think at a certain point the 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 dead would uh, just decompose completely? Better not. Gunfire would just bring more walkers. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Really? Job of making me not want to go any further. <laughs> that newspaper thing. Looks like it's still intact. Not for long. Locked. There we go. Back to the telescope. Been trying to back their boat into the water. Only things didn't go as planned. That's not really a boat that we can do anything with, though. I mean, it's not big enough for everybody there. It doesn't have any form of covering or sheltering on it. I mean, what the hell's the point of the, the boat? Where are we supposed to go? I think we can go very far in it. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the water line, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the... what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. Alright, let's have a look. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. No sign of any boats down there. Hey, right, nothing over that way. No way that one's salvageable. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. There's a bridge out here. What the hell? What the hell is Get he down. doing? Get down! What the fuck is going on? Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Sounds like a plan. I'm okay. interested. I need to you find it. You head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're going to talk. <laughs> I have to go up the middle. Wearing like a helmet or something. What the? Whoa! Ah! Fuck! <sighs> Shit, as my reactions aren't that good. Who the hell is this? Have you been following us? Following you?
Kenny, don't! Uh-oh. No, he's with us! Who the hell are you people? I asked you first. The name's Molly. Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. <laughs> you guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? I don't even know what that is. Everything beyond that barricade. What the hell happened here? You sure you want to know? I'm pretty sure I do. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. All the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus they sound like delightful Christ. people. Well, just the opposite, when you think about it. But still, Joe, you're not saying me. In God's name, why? No one stays in Crawford unless they can pull their own weight. Otherwise, you're just another mouth to feed, another drain on their precious resources. What does that mean, pull their own weight? It just means being able to help out, like you do all the time. Doesn't sound like any kind of way to live to me. Couldn't agree more. Fucking hell. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Does that imply Clementine's parents could be in there? Who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. <laughs> I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raised the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the area as they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. Yeah, that's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. <laughs> you just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Came down here looking for a boat. Hoping to get our people out of here and find someplace safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron, you want to keep your voice down? Shit. Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before... Oh, fuck. Right. Just right. Here they come! Isn't that the... Fuck. 
gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a... Follow Molly. Hey, you're just gonna leave us here? Sorry, I must have missed that part of our conversation where you became my problem. Don't leave us here, please. <laughs> Trust the child. Come on, make it fast. Uh, time to move. Oh, fuck me. Come on, come on, hurry. Right, come on, Lee. He's still in pain. Right. Okay. You could move faster. Uh oh. Jesus fuck. Right, where am I going? Come on, Lee! Get your ass out of there! Into the sewer. Into the sewer, go down. Fucking go! Can't get it open! Here, use that to pry it open. Fucking hell. Didn't give me much time to do this. Come on! I have no idea what the fuck that sound I made was. 